Hello everyone, how's it going? My name is Dan the Tutor. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the change of base formula for logarithms. This is one of the most niche little topics in all of Algebra 2 or pre-calculus. It's really not that important. And this is probably going to be a really short video. But sometimes you'll see questions like this in class. And ultimately, this is preparing for how we solve certain derivatives in calculus. But don't worry about that right now. Let's just talk about the change of base formula. So the formula goes something like this. If I have log base 3 of 10, then another way I can write this is log of 10 divided by log of 3. Where if you know what this is, this is called the common log. Whenever I don't have a base, there's a 10 by default. But again, I'm going to erase it because I don't need it. The point I'm trying to make here is that as long as you have the same base for both of these, these are going to be equivalent to each other. As a matter of fact, if I plug this in my calculator, this will be 2.0959, and the decimals go on for a long time. And by the way, there is a way, depending on your calculator, I have a TI-84, so I can actually do log base 3 of 10. I'd have to go to the math section and then scroll up to log base, and then you can find it there. But if your calculator can't do that, well, then you can use this formula instead. This is also true for any log, base, whatever. For instance, another popular one is the natural log. Natural log of 10 divided by natural log of 3. Plug this in a calculator and you'll get the exact same result, which makes this a pretty neat formula. So now we're just going to do a couple of example problems and we'll be done. So let's say I have log base 5 of 17 and I want to use change of base formula to evaluate this. So it's really easy. You can choose log base literally whatever you want. Personally, my favorite is the natural log, again, for reasons that have to do with calculus, but since this is not calculus, I don't care what you do. This is a perfectly good use of the change of base formula, and this is our answer. And in case you're curious what this is as a decimal, it's 1.760. And then just one more, because there's really no tricks I can show you here. But let's say I have log base 3 of 1 half. So for this one, it would just be natural log of 1 half or 0.5 divided by natural log of 3 and we're done that's it it's one of the easiest things in pre-calc and so hopefully you didn't have too much trouble with that if you do have any questions please post them in the comments thank you all for watching have a great rest of your day and i will see you in the next video take care and bye bye